Right now, families pleading for help after two men completely vanished. Tonight, Atlanta News First following up on a major discovery in their disappearance. And we do want to show you their faces. Jason Salter and Kenny Guerra, their friends and business partners who were last seen on Saturday. And those who knew them, they're putting together a desperate search. Atlanta News First reporter Rachel Aragon is live off Campbellton Road in East Point with these bizarre details. Rachel? Yeah, truly strange. We know, according to family members, they tell me earlier that one of the man's cars was found not too far from where I'm standing right here off of Campbellton Road in East Point. Family members say the other man's car was found at a different location, but still no word from either father or business partner. And now those two families coming together to ask community to help find them. In East Point, a growing mystery. Everybody that know Kenny and Jason, they love them. What started as a normal Saturday night. Kenny and Jason are very responsible men. Now leading to frustration and confusion as two families come together to help bring two of their loved ones home. This is a tragic to our family. We want to Baby's home. Jason Salter and his good friend and business partner, Kenny Guerra, have been missing since Saturday. Kenny's fiance says the last she heard from Kenny was that he was meeting up with Jason that day. It's not like him to not call me. It's not like him to not reach out to me. The two men, both fathers, run a print shop off of Old National Highway and are known for giving back to the community. Everybody that know Kenny and Jason, they love them. They they're good people at heart. They just have heart of gold and it's just, you know, it's crazy. So it's like we just ask the people if you know something, say something because we want them home. According to the police report, Jason's brother told investigators Jason had planned to meet with Kenny in East Point. Both families have not heard from their loved ones, but they're not giving up hope. Anybody feel like coming out to help us search? Come. I mean, we need all we can. We need all of you guys here to help us. And we've been told that East Point Police is taking the lead on this investigation. As you heard from the family, of course, anyone has any information about those two men or even saw them Saturday are urged to call police. We're live in East Point. Rachel Evergon, Atlanta News First. Rachel.